thing. I think these uh, enterprise software people have a hard, you know, management have a hard time getting people to use them because precisely because you know they one they're not fun. There's there's not there's no motivation for them to to use that software, right? So um, so gamification is in one way to provide the motivation. You know, not only provide the motivation, but also make it simple to do things, right? So I think I, I have a framework of, you know, how gamification should be implemented, you know. So you should have, you should start, you should aim at driving a convergence of three factors, okay? Mm -hmm. um, uh, the first factor is motivation. The second one is ability, meaning uh, people having the resource to do the task that they're, uh, they're, they need to do at a time. They need to do it. So, um, I mean, so a lot of people, and then uh, the last factor is uh, a trigger. So, uh, if you can have a temporal convergence of motivation, ability, and trigger, then people will do uh, the thing that you ask them to do. And because, you know, basically motivation just means that the person wants to do it, right? Ability means that they have the resource and the necessary, you know, resource to do what he needed to do at the time he needed to do them. Um, and these resources can be, you know, can be skill or right? or it can be simply time, right? Mm -hmm. For example, like I have the skill to, to send a tweet, but I can't do it right now. I don't have the ability to do it right now because I'm, I have interview. But I don't have the time, the time resource. Oops. That was a reminder for our, um, <laughs> for our <laughs> interview. Yeah. That just popped up. And yeah, uh, so like I don't have the time resource right now to to send a tweet because I'm interviewing with you, right? So that's uh, that means I don't have the ability to do it right now. You know, doesn't mean I don't have the skill to send a tweet. Anybody can send a tweet, right? So mm -hmm. it's, it's very simple. Uh, so um, yeah, so having the motivation and making it simple to do so that every, people require less, you know, uh, resource to do things, less time, uh, less energy, less, you know, thinking, less, you know, uh, all that makes, you know, making things simpler and it will help. And then the lastly, you want to have a trigger. You want to say, you know, like call to action, uh, do it you know, right now. And most people would do it. This, uh, this is actually a, a, a behavioral model from behavioral psychology. Uh, it's called a Fox uh, model is, is, um, uh, created by a, a professor in, in Stanford. Uh, it's called, a, uh, his name is BJ Fogg, um, and Professor Fogg and I kind of discussed this uh, before about, you know, what drive people to take action. And underlying every human behavior, usually there's a, this convergence of these three factors. So, so if we could, if software design can, uh, can implement some of these uh, uh, things, you know, uh, gamification ideas, into the design, then I think it would be, uh, they could drive adoption uh, easier. They have an easier time driving adoption.